the infamous ticking NXT brick. Now, I know that LEGO's moved on to the EV3 robots now, but if you've got one of these old ones and you have the ticking problem, I've read that Windows can accidentally assign the incorrect driver to this brick, and then you cannot update the firmware. Now, fortunately, I have a lot of computers in my lab, so I was able to just keep changing it around until I found a computer that didn't install the incorrect driver. Now, you can see here, when I've clicked on that down there, I've got LEGO Mindstorm's NXT Firmware Update Mode, mode installed. That's what you should see on the driver software installation. So that ticking sound means that it's ready to receive its firmware. So if you have the incorrect driver installed, this will not happen. You will not. Uh, the software, such as NXT programming, will not detect that brick. But now it will. So there's a program called... Uh, I think it's BOSSAC, B-O-S-S-A-C. Let's try Googling now. So sorry about using my camera to do this, but there, this is it. BOSSA, sorry, BOSSA driver prevents firmware upgrade. This is the issue. Now, I think Bossa, I've seen Bossa as a driver for the 3D printers, and there may be other hardware that uses the Bossa driver. So if you've got 3D printers installed, you may find that you cannot unbrick your LEGO robot because Windows automatically detects the incorrect driver if this is installed. So there you go, that might help.